which uh, movie star villain he wants to audition for. Because he looks like all of them. <laughs> Put your hands together for the Navy Matt Toker Rob! So, uh, my wife wanted me to get therapy, so I'm gonna count the next five minutes as my therapy. So thank you for coming. Uh, we used to call this, when I was growing up, uh, an intervention. Uh, it was usually followed by, or preceded by the words, court mandated. So, <laughs> nobody was here by court, were there? So, <laughs> so uh, I don't, I don't wanna, you know, soft story, but my mother, I believe, had it rougher than I did. See, my sister was born in August of one year, and the following year I was born in July. That's, yeah, that's a, <laughs> so yeah. We are Irish twins, exactly. And so, but I was born at 10 pounds, nine ounces. So, uh, yeah, I was the size of a Thanksgiving turkey. <laughs> so, uh, I did, I did. So, but, uh, checking my notes. Um, <laughs> right. You know, um, when I was born, uh, the doctor had to pull me out with forceps, which gave me the biggest of black eyes. And, well, me and my big head and my black eye, we really made a hit in the nursery, right? You know, nobody was mess with me. Because uh, <laughs> I was like the bad end of a monkey, really, honestly. <laughs> but, you know, back when they were uh, they were gonna take my baby picture, they, uh, they, they barely could get my head in the, the photo, you know, it was so big. You know, and then when they were taking me back to the new thing, not the nativity, I wasn't born to Jesus. <laughs> I like him. <laughs> you, know, I, I, you know, I really do like him. But I'm not that important in the, in the grand scheme of history. Of the humanity. So back when they put me back into the nursery, that's the word, um, I really had a lot of cradle credit, if we can call it like that. So, <laughs> Basically, it ended up turned out to be a black face, black eye. I mean, it, it encompassed a large area of me. And when you look at it, they would say, you know, you would see a baby color and you would say, ooh, ah, oh, you know? No, no, they said, oh, what? <laughs> oh, just little big eyes and, you know, for glances to the phone to call social services. <laughs> so, um, one of the things that uh, caused me from that was trust issues. So trust issues for me are like jelly beans. You know, anybody like jelly beans? Yeah. Yeah. So the red ones are like cherry, right? The black ones, licorice. What's the spotted ones? The multicolored ones that uh, don't really taste like anything that they should. They're suggestive flavors. Uh, they look like tummy birds, you know? But you know, when I taste them, they, they, they're more like what is that, bird spit? I mean, how do we do that? <laughs> Monkey leather? Uh, honey buttered cotton or mom balls? I meant to say that. <laughs> but yeah, it was, uh, so I have trust issues with that. So, but I, it keeps going in my life that, you know, with, uh, with, with trust is like the trust falls. You've ever done a trust fall? Ooh, yes, yes. We did one in college. Uh, it was great. Everybody was energized. It was amazing. People had so much fun and success. Nobody was dropped, except me. Oh. <laughs> now, I'm not a big guy. I mean, there was people bigger than me, smaller than me, everybody was okay. So I don't know about what, what about me was particularly heavy. You know, the, my sense of humanity, my impending fear of doom, uh, <laughs> my fear of their outstretched hands, and I'm pulling through them, which, they nailed that one. <laughs> so really, uh, yeah, that was a fun day. That for me. <laughs> Sorry, it's way too far away. Uh, we do um, have a good time at home, though. We we uh, foster kittens for nursing. You know, we nurse them out to be responsible Aww. adult cats. That's right. And uh, my wife was trying to take this video of a kitten the other day, and she was, you know, trying to make a noise, and this kitten was ignoring her. So my daughter suggested a different noise. And my wife comes up with, <laughs> I'm like, 
I looked at her incredulously, like, that's your go-to noise? <laughs> you sound like a, like a woman choking on a bone. <laughs> you know, something like that. Choose another sound. <laughs> but I, uh, I don't know about you guys, but I hate job interviews. You know, you, you, you get dressed up, you're wearing a tie, you're wearing your forced politeness. Wow, okay, gotta get this one. Good for a handshake. Uh, you like flashing a little bit of kids? Oh yes, that's my most favorite thing to do in the world. Yeah, that'd tell you where I like to be in five years. That's my most favorite thing to do. <laughs> so, I don't know about anybody else here, but if uh, if you ever get dressed in the middle of the night and dark, you ever have that trust issue with underwear? You know, it's like, is it is it front back? <laughs> Is it inside out? <laughs> Is it yours? <laughs> well, I know it's mine, and I know when it's not mine because my phone definitely gives you the sense of. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.